Hey tribe, notices welcome to Ghana that one of the local Ghanaian food festivals in Ghana. Today we are the biggest food festival in Ghana. Food has become one of the most famous African dishes, not just in Ghana, but Africa as a whole and even the whole globe. And today we are live here in Ghana where we are celebrating the dish that originally originated from Ghana while bringing you a taste of home with local live band performances, subshows, delicious Ghanaian food, meeting new friends and subscribers, celebrating together as one in Ghana where everyone is included in the rich celebration of culture and food and the togetherness of Ghanaians, Africans, Diasporians and everyone included. It's sit back, enjoy and don't forget to subscribe. Let's go guys. <laughs> <laughs> Are you celebrating? <laughs> this original Ghana movie. Hey, try. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to today's Enjoy. video. Vanessa here, and you know where we are headed already. Before we get on with it, if this is your first time on the channel, you will subscribe to the channel yet. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe for my returning subscribers. You guys are the bomb. Look how we do it. With no further ado, let's get on with the video, guys. It's about to be exciting. You do not want to miss any part. Let's go. All these red boo boo boo. Are you sure I'm okay? So well. Please don't miss me. We need this guy. Africa is early morning, six o'clock. met up with Andrea and Jenny already my guests were here today and everywhere was going already they were panting the fufu the suit here on fire the band was setting up people were already seated more were coming in the place was becoming so lively the best thing about this festival is that the food is prepared freshly like that pan the fufu right in front of us we just like standing and like waiting for this food to be ready so you can get book it down, you know how it is, right? I wanted to show you this whole process of how the food is made in Ghana. In case you're not from Ghana, you've always wondered how they make the food. This is how they plant it. It's really strenuous, but I'm the excited. And you know, it's always wherever there is soup, there is soups available. They have like different varieties of soups available. Most soups I've ever seen in Ghana, from the palm nut soup to the light soup to the okra soup to tomato soup and green soup, also known as a bonobono. I don't even pronounce it that very well. And different soups, I definitely do not even know the name. And the fun thing about it is. They have different options available for you. And just in case you are not into Fufu, who is not anyway? And just in case you are among the few that are not into Fufu, they have other options available for you. They have Banco available, they have rice balls available, they have the Omuto, rice balls and goat's meat and the rest of that. It's really amazing.
talent. There is Bangu and all close to you. There is a mood to only cut and coin and also. But don't be shy to face the wall if you like or contest. Now cut right. And of course, as we were standing and dancing and waiting for this people, we are about to devour more people were tripping in, people from different walks of life. You know, nothing bring people together more than food stores. And when it comes to food festival, Ghana is the place to be. If you buy food, you have to buy that food. American Embassy. Ladies and gentlemen, legendary Ninja Thai is in the house. Ninja Thai. So this American Embassy, it will be our last one before we start the jam. And then you have the bar session where they have different options of drinks if you want beer, you want wine, you want cocktail, whatever you are into, the beer and the fufu. Ooh, anyway, I'm a cocktail girl. Session where the alcohol looks like me. Now let's head on to the live bar session where the real party is going on. Enjoy. 
so we got a place to sit down so we can enjoy the party properly because everything is just getting heated so yeah the party is getting started and this sweetest thing happened to me ever this sweet genial lady basically approached me and was telling me how she's been telling her husband that was there at the party also that she's watching me on youtube she's a subscriber it was such a sweet experience it was one of the most sweetest encounter i've ever had sit back enjoy the moment for a bit because i'm still crushing even why i did this video i'm basically crushing i'm always watching you on So if you're that lady and you're watching this, thank you so much. You made the girls day. You definitely don't know what you did. It's always exciting when you see subscribers and the ones that show you kindness. I do not take any kindness for granted. So the shots you gave me, of course, I took it. I took it like a shout. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching my channel. Thank you. And if you're my subscriber, you see me anywhere in Ghana. Say hi. Say hi, please. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so much. God bless you so much. So now that I've shown you my meat kit moment, let's go enjoy the party. Let's go party the Ghanaian way. Let me go and show you the original Ghanaian moment. I will party in Ghana. One thing about Ghanaians is they are going to party. Like age, age has never been an issue with them. The way these guys they party, the way they boogie down, the way everyone just be genuinely enjoying themselves. 
is totally captivating and it's actually one of the reasons i love attending these festivals in ghana like it's contagious it's just like the happiness in the air the way everyone is just dancing and partying together and what way to bring the older generation of the Ghanaians to the dance floor than the old Ghanaian tunes local tunes from the local band this band were amazing and the party is just getting started we're all dancing partying you know it's fufu don't worry we're going to get to the fufu session in a bit but the party was so fun You know I'm always going to give you the behind the scenes. I'm sorry this video is too long, but I didn't want you to miss any part of this event because it was so fun. And I'm your girl to the backstage for the whole behind the scenes. So sit back, enjoy, don't go anywhere. If you don't like or you don't subscribe yet, don't forget to do that. Let's go. Now let's go get our food because I don't want to hear stories. I don't want to hear oh I had over food today because I didn't come all the way here and not eat anything. So let's go get our food guys.
so we ordered our fufu, the protein we wanted. You know, you have to like order the fufu. Then you take the fufu balls and you carry your bowl of fufu to where the soups are. Then you give them your, your receipt and then you take the protein you want and whichever soup you want. Oh my goodness, I'm always excited when there is food. And then there's three wraps of fufu because we are three and wanted to eat together. So no, I'm not the one eating the theory. But anyway, I can if I wanted to. So while we were eating, there was this girl sitting just in front of us. You would think we are having like a regular nice conversation, no? Start with, oh, what are you guys doing? You filming yourself eating? Oh yeah, we're content creators, we're creating content, so we're filming. So we felt like it was just like a fun conversation, right? No, it wasn't. You know what? Sometimes when you go to events like this, you meet the nice ones and you meet the not so nice ones. She went ahead and started asking us our nationality and why we are in Ghana and how we are in Ghana. I just didn't want to include her face in this vlog. I was just laughing because mostly, mostly when you reply to people back, the way they are asking you these offensive or rude questions, you can easily become the the rude foreigner in Ghana because there were other nationalities there, there were white people there. I didn't see her approaching those white persons and asking them why they are in Ghana or why they how they are in Ghana and the rest of that. I'm like, do you need my passport? Do you need my permit? Is there anything you need? Are you immigration? Is there anything you want from me? Or do you want to come home with me to see everything? Or should I be moving around with this? Or are you even supposed to ask me in an event like this? I just want to put her here. And then she collected our YouTube uh, handle before the whole conversation ensued. So if you're here, you're watching ISIS. 
you need to do better when you meet foreigners or people you do not know you have to be a bit nicer you had no right to start asking us questions you were asking us we were not in any situation that warranted you asking us those questions who you from kenya who you from nigeria what are you doing here are you here why are you living here where you live definitely did not approach the americans here like we see africa man to africa man basically but it was totally rude and please if you're doing that to other persons and no one has told you don't do that before no it's rude I just wanted to include the part of the conversation so you know what I'm talking about. The questions were like, are you Kenyans? Or like, oh no, Kenya, Nigeria. The next thing is, are you schooling here? Oh no, we're not schooling here. We live here. Do you have a resident permit? Oh, yes, we do. We we'll live here. We we'll have a resident permit. And then the next question, is, how did you get the resident permit? And why did you get the resident permit? Basically. Anyway, we're really offended, but we do want to like make it a, a situation. I just wanted to add it that just so you see the kind of things we deal with sometimes when we're at in Ghana, which is completely not fair for any African to have to deal with that. In Africa, like irregular citizen basically approaching us, asking us these questions. But I don't want to like end this vlog on a very rough note or oh, oh, this and that note. So yeah, let's get back to our food and get back to partying, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying this vlog. If you're here, you're watching, if you're not subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Let's go, guys. Yeah.